Hello. Okay, everyone, this is Ank Erdin from Mongolia, and yes. he has won Mongolia's Got Talent. Тэгэг миний мөрөдөл маань дуучин болох байсан. Нэг тийм болохоор би яг авиаслан монголч хэд. Аа 2016 онд орж ирсэн. Heidi, your turn. Come to mommy. Oh, oh. oh don't, Whoa. Heidi. He is good. Did you want this one? Yes, Simon? I did. He's amazing. Mongolia's got talent. The winner. How are you? I chose you because your voice is amazing. And because also you're a winner. And I like winning also. <laughs> <laughs> are you a little bit nervous? Yeah. yeah. So I think it's important to project because you have a star voice. I'm a teacher. That's in the right book. The park. Ah, you want to get better? Just check Tom Bettler or something. Then I'm going to Tom Bettler. Just to see him. Then I'll do that. In order to be balanced, I'm sure you're going to do it. Did you mentor in Mongolian? I've been to Mongolia. I went That's to the. That's not what I asked. I uh, no, I didn't. Okay, here we go. Ten seconds. Six, five seconds. And I got friends in low places where the whiskey drowns in the beer. Jesus, my blues away. Is that coming out of him? And I'll be okay. I was not expecting that from Mongolia. <laughs> Blaming all my roots, I sure them boots. Ruined your bike top fear. Last one knew, you last one to show. I was the last one you thought you see there. And I saw the surprise, the fear in his eyes, and I took his glass of champagne. And I do said you say don't even make it through, but you never hear me complain. <laughs> I feel like Mel B. I'm confused. <laughs> Was he lip syncing? No, of course not. No, no one can lip sync on American. Were you Mandela. lip syncing? No. Don't judge a book by its cover, Howie Mandel. Yeah. How would you even know this kind of music? How did you get into this kind of uh, music? It's called the internet. <laughs> you don't find this amazing? Yes. Of course. That's why but he is I, on my I'm dream not, team. I'm not surprised. This is exactly what this young man should be singing. Yee because to your that. tone is stunning. Absolutely yeah. stunning. I love this performance. Yes, love. Thank you. What I would like to have seen is for the music just to stop and for you to do like an a cappella. Because I need to uh, hear this guy no, sing. No, no. Do you know next what? Round, Can I say something? Round. Maybe next time next you round. start a cappella. That was uh, my idea, Simon. Not now it isn't. I think, and then I think, I think. The track comes you know what? Doesn't matter, it was brilliant. Thank you so much, you were amazing. Thank you. Thank you. I'm Lauren Allred. I'm from Brooklyn, New York, and I'm a singer. Um, one of my favorite movies ever was 
The Greatest Showman. Mm -hmm. And one of my favorite songs in the movie is the song Never Enough. And then I found out, actually, the girl who sings the song in the movie wasn't singing the song. It was actually Lauren's vocal. Oh, that's crazy. That's crazy. Okay. Growing up, music's always been a really big part of my life. My parents are both music teachers, and I always loved to sing, and I would sing in my room for hours and hours and hours, but I was too shy to do it in public. <laughs> when I was around 24, I had been waitressing for a while, and then I met the songwriters for the movie The Greatest Showman. They said, you know, we have a song, Never Enough. Can you come in and sing the demo for it? So they can show it to whoever they want to sing it eventually. I went into the studio and I sang the song, and then they said, we're thinking about having the actress lip sync to your vocal. And I just thought, oh my gosh. I was so excited to just have my voice be in the film. I felt so proud because, you know, people were hearing my voice and that's what I had dreamed of. But people didn't know that I had sung the song in the movie. So when they heard me singing, people would say, you sound just like the movie. Wow. And it wasn't really until that moment that I thought, I need to just go for this. But I wasn't really ready for a stage like America's Got Talent. And so I decided to go on Britain's Got Talent to get my feet wet. Some of you guys have actually heard my voice, but you don't know my face. I sang the song Never Enough on The Greatest Sh Showman. Yeah. Oh my God! I went on that stage and I did the scariest thing for me. I knew this moment could be make or break it for me. It just felt so validating. It really was a dream come true. Lauren Allred, you are not in the final three. I did not win, but I faced my fear. And I was really, really proud of, of that. You know, I was actually very starstruck. Oh, really? Yeah, for me, this is almost like being in a movie right now. I really think you should sing Never Enough. Let's do something unbelievable where everyone goes, oh my God. God, I've never heard that version before. Yeah. This version of Never Enough is brand new. I think it's a step up. I'm going to be testing my vocal range. I'm 34 years old, and I just felt like if I don't give this one more shot, shot yeah. and be fearless, then yeah. I might regret it. I have big dreams. I want to be on Broadway, put out my own albums. And I feel like if I just knock it out of the park tonight, then maybe those dreams can come true. I'm trying to hold my breath Let it stay this way Can't let this moment end Take my hand Will you share this with me? Cause darling, without you
Thank you, Lauren. Howie. Wow. Wow. I mean, that's amazing that such great talent is so not known and behind the scenes and so wonderful of you to bring it forward and introduce it to the world. Look up, cause here I, I mean, how lucky are all of us right now that we got to witness this live right in front of our eyes. It was just absolutely beautiful. Thank you so much, Heidi. Thank you. Mel. <laughs> I'm actually lost for words because that is just amazing what you can do. Thank I'm you so much. Away. Thank I'm blown you. away. That was honestly spectacular. And to have that moment almost taken away from you. Yeah. And no one knows it was you. And now you've got the guts to come back on this show and tell America this is me is so special. I really hope that America get behind yeah. you and give you the break that I genuinely believe that you deserve because you are an extraordinarily good artist. You know, there was, there was a while when I was more comfortable singing behind the scenes and I thought maybe that's what I was meant to do. And no, until never, no, <laughs> until no, now, no. you know, I'm ready and I'm here. And thank you for giving me this opportunity. Thank you. My name's Sophie Dossi and I'm 14 years old. What is it you're going to be doing for us today? I'll be doing hand bounce and contortion. I had discovered a YouTube video of a contortionist and thought it was really cool. I would watch these videos over and over until I got those moves just right. I just kept teaching myself at home and it became an obsession with me. <laughs> I was so young, I was so new to everything. What planet are you from? <laughs> I've always watched America's Got Talent and never would have thought in a million years it would change the rest of my life. I've had so many doors open up for me since. I started a YouTube channel that has almost 10 million subscribers. I've even released my own music and guest starred on some TV shows. But when I found out I was chosen for Fantasy League, I was so honored. I felt like I had to make America proud. And being on Heidi's dream team, I'm so excited. <laughs> Hello! Hi. I've been a fan of her since I first saw her. I mean, when you look at her on all her social media platforms, she's become, you know, really like a superstar. What is this? So Gorgeousness. These are my designs for bodysuits. You actually drew these? I drew these, yes. You're good. This time I'm really taking it to the next level in the sense of danger Ooh. and would you be surrounded like, by fire? That, you know? I mean, that could really be cool too. Yeah. Let's smoke this place up. Okay, here we go. Yeah. I want to show Heidi that she was right to pick me for her dream team. This time, I'm here to win.
just saw how amazing Sophia is. I mean, bam! Thank you. Can I say something? And I mean this. Listen, this is competitive, and I don't like to give my uh, fellow uh, mentors credit. But keep it coming. Go on. But if, if tonight was my golden buzzer, I would use it on you. I definitely would. Thank you. Would. I think I'm going to have to agree with Howie because that looked very well rehearsed and slick. Thank well you done. so much. Thank you. Okay, so I felt actually quite emotional, Sophie, because I'm seeing you grow as an artist and have the guts to come back and compete again against some of the best acts in the world and actually get better. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. I have a feeling this might be your year. Thank you so much. And because timing is everything, and I don't want anyone to kerfuffle this, as Mel would say, I will give you this golden buzzer no way. right now. My dreams come alive. There's only five spots only left. Five spots. Sophie Dossi, you are going straight to the AGT Fantasy League final. This, this is so insane. I mean, I'm like speechless right now. Uh, I don't know what to say. I want to say that you did not really actually need my golden buzzer, but you know, I push it for you because I love you and I believe in you and I think you're amazing. That was great. One more time for Sophie Darcy. Hello, ladies. Hi. How are you? Good. So good. How are y'all? I'm so excited that you're here tonight. Before coming to AGT, there was a lot of no's and a lot of closed doors and... A lot. A lot. A whole lot. We've been trying to break into Nashville for the last couple of years. It's been kind of hard when I think country music doesn't always look like us. Well, you can have him too. Somebody get out your seat tonight! You may have just broken down the door with that performance, trust me. We look up and we hear Simon counting down. And Five, when we see four, three, three, two, two one. It felt like the world made sense. It felt like America got us. Things are gonna go very well for Chapel Hot. I remember having that hope that like we really could win. Chapel Hot, you made the AGT final! <laughs> We decided to do our original song, American Pride. But singing a song that meant so much to us, the walls had come down. We just left our hearts out there. We just cried throughout the entire performance. Some of the vocals were off, and maybe because you were emotional and because there was a lot of pressure. It, it, was, a, it was hard. It was hard to have to face that you won't be winning at all. As soon as we found out that there was going to be a fantasy league, we were like, we don't want to get anybody but Simon. <gasps> hello? <laughs> oh, hello! Simon is the ultimate group mentor. If you want my honest opinion, uh -huh. I think you should redo American Pride properly. Oh, wow. OK. Mm -hmm. It's such a risk because if the world has seen you fall on your face once, do you really want to try it again? It's like <laughs> so good. This song's a hit. Mm. It really, really is a hit. And, you know, I, I think the song needs a big ending. Mm -hmm. But most importantly, people have got to listen to the lyric of that song. America chose you. 
for a reason. To be back and be on your dream team is everything to us, and we're excited to give this song another, another, another chance. Shot. Okay, here we go. Grab your seats, please. We feel like this is our moment of redemption. Simon is the secret sauce that's going to bring this all the way to the mm -hmm. top. God, I feel very nervous. Good. That means you care. I Good. do care. I really Good. do care. Five seconds, four, three, two. I grew up in America at a time that wasn't so bad. We were raised out in Steep Holler, did the best with what we had. We had it all, loving neighbors, land, and freedom. And that's what built me in my American pride. So I know that we can do this. Hold hands and step aside. Let love pour out between us. Move the hate and let's just try. and this land and you'll ride for freedom and I know that we can do this hold hands and step aside let love pour out between us move the hate and let's just try I believe we'll make a difference be one person If you need the love that's true, need someone to stand by you. Wow. That was a moment. All right, all right, Simon. I'll give you that one, Simon. All right, all Whoa. right. Mel? Well, I mean, I could just tell how much you want this and the energy coming off that stage. Everybody got out of their seats, and that's saying something. I loved it. The fact that you sang that song again, and we are living in the times we're living in, I felt like that was an anthem. Yeah. Yeah. Only five acts can go through, yeah. and I want you to be one of them. But it's up to the voting audience. Chapel Heart, you are a fan favorite. You're one of my personal favorites. Love you, girls. I also love the way you look today. I know that he had nothing to do with that. You look absolutely beautiful. Thank you so much. This tonight was about redemption. And you know what? You absolutely nailed it. I've got to know the ladies pretty well. And I can tell you this. They are sincere. They've had not an easy time getting the Nashville to get behind them. But you've never given up. I just want to say thank you so much for, for seeing us and believing in us and believing in us enough for us to come back and do it again.
And we just want to say thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Making paper airplanes reminds me of fond memories. Well, as we grow older, our memories fade with time. It's gone. Memories are invisible. What are the most precious things in my life? over there on the other end. I was say excited. It, say it. Obviously being uh, used mentor, it's it's special. <laughs> You're not his mentor. <laughs> You're not. We, we have a connection. You've developed this very cool, laid back, Vegas style persona, world class. I agree. Now, you're not just cool, you're kind of very slick and very confident. I love how you are with it all. It's like, yeah, I can do this, yeah, I can do that. It's good. <laughs> Thank Very you so good. much. Hello. Hi, Fritzy. Fritzy's only 15 years old. Fritzy, oh. tell everybody about yourself, like where you're from and what you've done. My name is Fritzy. I'm from Indonesia, and I'm a top five in Indonesia's Got Talent. <laughs> I realized that I had special abilities when I was seven years old. I discovered that I could influence people around me and I can hang into their minds. I made it all the way into the top five of Indonesia's Got Talent. You got four years oh, Thank you. Ritzy, how are you? People love magic and I think this is exactly what my dream team needed. The reason you're here is America chose you. You have over 40 million people all over the world that clicked on you on social media. Well, who is that? I will tell you in this stage. So you don't want it, you want to surprise me? Yeah, I want to surprise you. Okay, so can I help you in any way? Do you need anything from me? Yes, I need your advice. My advice is involve the judges. Just be yourself. For this performance, I'm going to hack into the judges' minds. I'm going to use my skills to win. This is 
my friend. He's been my magical sidekick since I was seven. We're best friends. Say hi to everyone. Mm, I guess he's a little shy. May I join with you? Yes. Howie? Yes. Do you believe that my friend can tell you his name? Yes. Okay, now close your eyes. Okay. Try to focus and connect with my friend. My friend will tell you his name. <laughs> you got a name? I did. Okay, now open your eyes, write the name and then turn the pad over. Okay. Don't show to anyone. And what? Show it to Turn everyone the and turn over. it back over. Show it to everyone? You're the mentor. No, don't show it to anyone. Oh, don't show it to anyone. Yes. Did you mentor this act or not? It's over. It's turned over. Thanks, Howie. Everyone, let's give Howie a hand. <laughs> Heidi? Yes. Do you believe that my friend can read your mind? Maybe, yeah. Okay, let's try that. Okay. Can you sing one color? Mm hmm Are you done? Mm hmm Hmm. Hmm. Okay, let's say it together in a count of three. Okay. One, two, three. Red. Red? You choose red? Yes. Oh dear, my friend is a bit chat like. Okay, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> now, Melby, can you please check my blindfold? Make sure it's legit. Yes. Okay, thank you. And Simon, can you hold onto this doll? Yes. Thanks. Okay, Simon, in a second, you will throw the doll into the audience. Anywhere? I'm covering my eyes to connect with my friend. Simon, please throw it. Yeah, they have it. Hello. Hi. What was that? Okay. Are you wearing a navy t-shirt? Yeah. Are you wearing glasses? Yeah. Hold on. Wow, no, that's wild. Thank you. Oh. Howie, you wrote down my friend's name earlier. Yes, I did. Now, for the first time, can you show us the name you wrote down? Yes. I wrote down my name backwards. So... Iwa. Iwa? Iwa. Iwa. Okay, Iwa. I just got my friend a name necklace yesterday. Yes. So, the name is... That says Iwa. And Heidi, look, it's your color. I know, it's red. Purple. Love it. My name is Betsy. Thank you very much. Love it. Yeah. Yes. You can check it. Wow, look, it's red and it says Ewa. Why did red. you have to pick such a complicated name? That was fantastic. You're only 15 Thank years you. old. It's your first time in America. That was magical. What did you think, Heidi? I liked it. I mean, I was confused at times, but we got there. I mean, you as a person, you're so adorable and you're so cute, but I think this act was a little bit small for this stage. And I think what you can take from that is Think even bigger and better. That's good. All That's right. good advice. Simon? Um, I think because we've seen so much amazing magic over the years, this didn't have that wow moment. What? I think you got the wrong mentor, if I'm being honest with you, Fritzy. I think, um, look, what? this is, harsh I get words, it, you're 15. It still works. It did. Yeah. But there's only five acts that are going to go through to the next round. So good luck. Just one night all we got. Just one night all we got. I ain't got time for you, baby.
is crazy. We gotta bring that fire. Now, Simon, that is how you mentor your team. Okay. Oh my God, guys, that was just I, I did actually ask Mel, you know, did you have anything to do with the music? She said yes. <laughs> and obviously, when I heard the second track, your ego is out of control. <laughs> I think this is like the only dance group I've ever seen in the world who do what they do, yeah, which exactly. makes you stand out. And that's important. When you do a flip and you land on those heels, it's insane. How can you land on those heels? It's amazing. I wish you the best of luck. I wish it was up to us, but it's up to the audience. Team Mel B! Team Mel B! I love you guys. Thank you so much. I have to give it to you now. What we're talking about. Hi, Perry, how are you? I'm feeling so good right now. I can't wait for this one. Every time I think of you, I think this would make the most amazing Super Bowl act. That means a lot. Thank you. When we first came on this show, we were just a bunch of kids from Chicago looking for opportunity. But now, after a year performing in Las Vegas, performing with the Chicago Bulls, performing all over the world, we know one thing, we coming into this competition to win. Yes. I like that. That's it. OK. Just do your thing. This is power. It is. Power. You really fired them up. Yeah, I did. That is a Super Bowl moment right there. Thank you. That is better Thank you. than anything you have done before on the GT stage. You. And you are, in my mind, tonight the one to beat. Thank you. Thank you. I'm actually really annoyed at myself. Because you're on Simon's dream team and you just killed it!
Thank you. I appreciate that. There are occasions, you know, with an artist where you look into their eyes and you see steel. That, to me, is the sign mm -hmm. of a fighter and a star. There are other artists who are favorites to win, but I have a feeling that you are gonna surprise everyone and win this whole show. Wow. It's been an absolute honor and I could not be happy. I feel like a proud right, parent right Simon. now. I do. All right, all right, I all do. Right. Thank you all so much. My name is Ichikawa. I'm 43. I'm from Japan. And I'm a semi finalist on British Got Talent. I'm a wind musician. A wind musician? Yeah. BGT. The I didn't know what was going on, and then I understood. Taiwanにはサイモンオクトだけやったんですよ。涙出ました。チャレンジしたんですよ。それがセミファイナルで。一から Ichikawa. Hi. Hi. I'm Howie. Howie, yeah. What you do is going to leave America in awe. America? Can I go to America? Yeah, you're coming to America. Whoa! Second chance. Ichi. To have a gift like you have. It's not a talent that we have ever had on our stage before. When you go out there, just don't be nervous. Just let it go. Bubbles. Simon, no, Simon, go no, on up. No, 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 no. Simon, no. Simon. No, be It's that. your act. Your Mel. Act. You're the mentor. Mel. How are we? How are we? Hide it. How are we? I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. Thank you. Please come here, please. How are we? Good afternoon. Thank you. Yeah. What are you gonna do with the big balloon? Sit, breathe. All right. And 
wear a helmet, okay? All right, safety first. Yeah. All right. <laughs> please, everybody. Howie, Is it Kawa? Don't move! That's a dart. Oh. oh, oh no. Young man, put the F in artistry. <laughs> you can win $250,000 with that talent. Heidi. It didn't stink. No, sir, man. I've seen you online. You've blown candles out before on a birthday cake. But yeah. this, dangerous. How do you know boss dance again? You got to Heidi, we will be at your birthday anytime you want. He can help blow out the candles. That's a good idea. I'm glad nobody lit a match. Mel. No. Oh. Just a moment, please. Just a moment, please. You, wait, wait. This is for you, Mel. Present for you. Oh. Oh, hell no. Um, look, I always like acts that are the best at what they do right in the world. Yeah. Is there anyone who does that better in the world? Arguably, no. I started making noises when I was a kid. Every noise I heard, I imitate. When I was 20 years old, I dream I was on stage, but it's just a dream and I never make a move. One day, I said, okay, I will go to Canada's Got Talent. My biggest dream is to find something that we haven't seen before. This is the moment that it happened. When are we? Go to the, the golden buzzer and press. I scream like a woman of a baby. Hey! You have such a unique talent. I am so excited to be working with you. Me too. I think what you do is like a movie soundtrack, and that's what you have to do. Thank you. We're gonna win. We're gonna win. I can't win. Take your seats, please. Here we go. Well, you have an Howie Dream Team. I do. Go right ahead. Tonight I'm competing with the best of the best. Hi! I'm gonna win. Not just for me, for Howie.
Sae. Simon, you're very interesting. I like those, you know, the David Attenborough <laughs> type of things. So, <laughs> look, it is incredible. But then I'm thinking in the context of a Vegas show, right. which is, are you going to sit there for two hours and listen to a frog? <laughs> no, but she does so much more. I think it's great. Mel? I was confused because I didn't <laughs> know what animal was what. I think I would have liked to have gone, right, this is now an elephant. Oh, this there is was now no a, elephant. The words there was drum, drum, drum. <laughs> what is wrong with both of you? A frog and an elephant. Oh my God. But Howie, I think you have to take this as a note, and maybe you need to approach your mentoring a little bit differently. Yeah. I totally agree. Yeah. They don't. They don't understand animals if it's not a dog. <laughs> it's like a soundtrack and animal sounds and music and singing come out of one person. You took me off to the rainforest. I loved it. Thank you, Genevieve. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Junior new system and pack drumline. Please step forward. Oh. The act going into the semifinals is... <laughs> Pack Drumline! <laughs> Congratulations, Pack Drumline! Simon Mentor, better than you, Mentor. Good mentoring. One down, four spots left. Ank Erdeen. And jean Viev Cote. The act going into the semifinals is... Let's keep it going. Fritzy Rosemarian. And Yu Ho Jin. The act going into the semifinals is. Still got one left. I still got one left. Okay, we've still got three acts, and there are only two spots. Chapel Heart. Ichikawa Kokuchi. And Lauren Allred. The next act going into the semifinals is. There is just one spot left. I don't know, you know. <laughs> Look, they were shouting for I know. I'd be worried. The act staying in the competition is... Chapel Heart! 
Let's hear it for your semifinalists. Chapel Hart, Lauren Allred, Pat Drumline, Anker Dean, Yu Ho Jin, and our golden buzzer finalist, Sophie Dossi. Howie, you had zero acts through tonight. What do you want to say? No, I don't want to say anything. And you don't have to point it out. I think people can count. <laughs> Holly, you weren't alone. Mel B didn't have All any right. extra either. You don't need to rub it in. I know. I know. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Let's just go and celebrate. Come on, everyone. Come on, that's it. Yes. Come on. A big congratulations to all of you. We are back next week with 10 more of the world's best acts. I'm Terry Crews. Good night, America.